biggest takeaway is that when you make that transition, you, you now want to do it because you see all the benefits that you probably didn't before. Your son's one, your energy level's another, your company performance. That doesn't mean that, okay, I, I worked out today. I have a positive attitude. You know, we're going to start making millions of dollars. It doesn't work that way. What does change though is your ability to adapt to that to, to the same struggles that you have in a better, more positive way, which ultimately gets you through it quicker and more effectively. You're not dwelling on something for three weeks, eating a bag of potato chips every night, feeling like a piece of garbage only to wake up and feel worse. And then you have to slog through whatever it is that gets you there in the first place. You know what I mean? You're not your story is kind of the buzzword. You're not your story. What happens to you is not something that you can control. What you can control is how you react to it. Your environment is going to be your environment. You can't say, I'm never going to end a relationship. You can't say a relationship's never going to end. You can't say I'm going to cross the street and never get hit by a car. But what you can say is if this does happen, my mindset is such that I will be able to deal with it. You might not know how to, but the mindset, the priority is me. I, I can deal with it better. It doesn't necessarily always translate to monetary success if we're talking about your company or relationship but at least you can feel better about yourself. And, and that's positive, you know? 